You know, since this is another episode with the Freckle Gang actually doing another broadcast news show, I decided to bring a very, very, very special YouTuber guest on this show. And lucky I was able to meet him for the first time back in 2022, and then I met him again in 2023. I never used to like this YouTuber, but suddenly I just grew to him the moment he started bashing some Disney remakes. And so him and I actually spoke one time at Comic-Con in Grand Rapids, and this is the very first time I ever brought a famous YouTuber critic on my show. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages, I give you all the one and only... Hello, I'm the Nostalgia Critic. I remember, so you don't have to. It is such a delightfully treat to actually see you here on my show today, Nostalgia Critic. I'm the Loud House Critic himself, and I review Loud House episodes from Nickelodeon. And I'm still hoping that you can actually review The Adventures of Pinocchio from 1996 with Jonathan Taylor Thomas in it. Because I did give you the DVD of that movie. So what do you think of The Loud House? Oh, what can I say about The Loud House? I've n never seen an episode, but I know what it is. If you show me, like, a picture of it, like, I recognize it. Uh, it's a bunch of little kids in the house, right? Like, it's a cartoon. Yeah, uh, it is. Nickelodeon, I think? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Uh, One boy, ten girls. Uh, that's about all I know. <laughs> <laughs> so there's nothing else. Like, you never know there was a Loud House movie about it. Nope. Kitty, I was so looking forward to you badly criticizing that movie. Okay, so truth be told, I've never watched The Loud House before, and I would gladly say that I'm better off watching some of the best nostalgic shows of Nickelodeon, like Rugrats, SpongeBob, Hey Arnold, Cat Dog, all the good times from the 90s. With The Loud House, I don't see much interest with the show. Oh, some of the best classic Nickelodeon shows from the 90s. I love those shows. But I also did appreciate Jimmy Neutron and Danny Phantom. And then I stopped watching Nickelodeon for a very long time until The Loud House actually came on television. It looked very interesting. Then again, you have your own interests. I got mine. Oh, it's just one boy with ten sisters doing chaos. This is nice, but again, I have no interest in modern show. Good day, sir! Okay, so... Back to me again. 